Thanks for calling Wellington Implement. Remember last winter when Hank Drucker used that tiny garage of his for making bootleg hooch? He had to leave his zero-turn mower outdoors. Come springtime, he pulled off the tarp and outrushed five baby raccoons and their rather unpleasant mama. FYI, Hank is terrified of raccoons, so I hear there was a fair amount of screaming involved. But this winter, Hank opted for our indoor storage service for just $99.95. His mower's gonna stay safe, and with any luck, his nightmares will start to taper off. Ran into Barney Crumb at the hardware store a few days back. He's still got that jig hook stuck in his cheek, going on seven weeks now, so he ain't been fishing in a while. Following a long year on the job, your farm and construction equipment might enjoy some love and attention. After all, tractors and backhoes are people too. Our in-shop postseason inspections start at $299. If you'd rather, we can come out to your place and inspect your machines for a labor rate of just $125 per hour. We'll even toss in engine service for as low as $199 plus parts. It's the best return on your money you'll get all year. Unless, of course, you've figured out a way to cheat the lottery. A couple young fellas were in the shop last weekend taking pictures of our Cub Cadet commercial zero-turn stand-on mowers. I asked if I could help them with anything, and they said no. They were just trying to decide which mower to have made into matching neck tattoos. As I walked away, I think they could sense my disappointment. Not that icy roads and bone-chilling winds aren't terrific, but we think the best part about the colder months is our annual winter service special. Why? Well, bringing your mower in now helps you avoid the spring rush and the annual service backlog. You'll enjoy our best prices of the year, and equipment that's professionally serviced lasts longer. There's a joke in there somewhere, but I'm going to let it slide on by. All the juicy details are waiting for you online at winterservicespecial.com. The other day, Marv Gooner told me he's allergic to corn all of a sudden, which I thought was a bit odd, seeing as he's been growing it for the last 25 years. He said while he was standing near his corn crib last week, his eyes started to water, his throat tightened up, his heart rate jumped, and he almost fainted. His upper thigh even started to bleed. Turns out he was just shot in the leg, so that was a relief. Here at Wellington Implement, we've got more than 70 people across three locations who'd like nothing more than to help you get your work done a little faster and a little easier. Actually, they'd like nothing more than a chocolate milkshake right now, but helping you get your work done is a close second. They're only human, after all. If you know Alice Shanks up the road a piece, you know that she's very particular about her diet. She only eats what she grows or raises herself. Alice is well dried up last week, so now she wants to start making her own water, too. But she's a little short on hydrogen these days. If you could spare any, I'm sure she'd appreciate it. Mm -hmm. 